Michigan Stadium in Ann Arbor, also known as Tree City. And I hope these fans are as bundled up as I am for today's matchup between the Indiana Hoosiers and the Michigan Wolverines. Here come the Wolverines! Hi and welcome everyone to another great college football game brought to you by the fine folks at EA Sports. I'm Brad Nessler with Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. The Wolverines are much too powerful to be stopped in this game. Kirk, what are your thoughts? Well, I agree with you. I don't think this one will be close at all. Indiana has spent all week trying to figure out how they're going to slow this running back down. Well, Lee, in my opinion, they could have spent all year. It still won't matter. He's going to have a big day and a big win. Yep, no question, Kirk. Michigan is going to go after the defensive front early and just pound them. Kirk, don't be surprised if these guys don't run for 400 yards in this football game. Easy win. We're hoping for a great game. Guys, let's get down on the field. The team captains are ready for the coin toss. We're ready to get this one underway as the teams are lined up for the opening kick. Here's the kick. Jackson fields it in the end zone. They'll take over at the 26-yard line. Indiana brings in their nickel package. Number 16 drops back, steps up, he wants it all, going long, complete, he spins around, and he's tackled at the 21. The wideout comes up with a spectacular play. Yeah, and if I'm the coach, I put a big circle around that play, so I can remember to call that one again. Good call. First and 10, ball on the 21-yard line. Indiana comes out in a 3-4. Number 16, back to pass. Smith tips it away. And that was a good defensive play. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. And second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 21-yard line. Number 16 with three wide receivers. Back to pass. Under pressure. Fumbles the ball. Smith recovers a loose ball. And he's hammered down. And so they'll turn the ball over on the fumble. Yeah, the ball carrier just didn't do a good job of protecting the ball. This defense took advantage of it. It's first and ten. Ball on the 26. The Wolverine use a four-man front here. Jones drops back to pass. He lets it go. Incomplete pass. The pass ball's incomplete. Number 19, the intended receiver on the play. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 26-yard line. Indiana sets up in the eye. Number 90 with a takedown at the 28-yard line. Couple of yards there. Third and eight, ball on the 28-yard line. The Hoosiers go with the eye formation. Drops back to pass. He passes it incomplete. Fourth 
fourth down, eight yards to go. Ball on their own 28. Number 38 set to punt. Curry calls for the fair catch. He hauls it in at the 32-yard line. They'll go to work at the 32. Indiana lines up defensively in a 4-3. Number 16, hands off to the left. This tackle. He's to the 40. He's to the 50. And they finally make the stop at the 42-yard line. And he broke one for about a mile there. You know, guys, it's going to be interesting to see how this defense adjusts to the running game. Here's another look. It's first and ten. Ball on the 42-yard line. The Hoosier put four men up front. He tries to spin. Barnett brings him down at the 39. A gain of three yards by the fullback. Second and seven. Ball on the 39. Indiana lines up with five defensive backs. Number 16, back to throw. Throws it out there. And he probably should never have thrown that ball. Yeah, sometimes as a quarterback, it's better to get sacked than to take your chances with throws like that. First and 10, ball on the 26. The Hoosiers line up in an I formation. Tackle at the 29. And the halfback carries for a pickup of three. Second and seven. Ball on the 29 yard line. They come out with a big set. He drops back. He throws it. It's dropped. How about that? He's got to come up with that catch here. Yeah, you're right, Coach. This is a catch that has to be made. There's really no excuse for dropping that ball. It's third down and seven to go. Ball in the 29. Michigan lines up defensively in a 4-3. Jones on the option. Number two brings him down for a loss. And the defense is ready for that play. Boy, you better believe that that play didn't have a chance. It's fourth down, nine yards to go. Ball on the 27. Curry, the return man. Curry signals for a fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 30-yard line. They'll get the ball here at the 30. Michigan sets up with four receivers. Back to pass. Looking. He's looking for his man. And it's caught. Stone with a takedown at the 24-yard line. Good looking play there. I think they did a great job up front here, allowing the quarterback enough time to look downfield and spot the open man. Yeah, but don't forget to play that receiver that time. He made some really nice moves. First and ten, ball on the 24. Three-man front defensively. 
Number 16, off the fake. And they got him. Boy, they got some major heat on the quarterback that time. Well, that's the whole goal of the defense. They're going to attack him by bringing multiple looks and blitzing from the linebackers in the secondary to try to confuse him. Second down, 14 coming up here. Ball on the 28. Number 16 has five receivers lined up here. Drop back to pass. He unloads it. And that one's fallen incomplete in the direction of his wideout. There was no way that his receiver could have gotten to that one. It's third down and 14 to go. Ball on the 28. The Hoosiers line up with six defensive backs. He drops back, lets it go, and it falls incomplete. And he just threw that one behind his receiver. Yeah, that was just a poor throw. I'm sure that quarterback would love to have that one back. It's fourth down and 14. Ball on the 28. It looks like they're going to try for the long field goal. The kick is up. It hits the crossbar and bounces through. I don't think I've ever seen the ball hit the crossbar like that and then bounce through. <laughs> I think that's the first time I've ever seen that too. That's, that's an unbelievable play. Michigan to kick this one off. Kicks it off. Carter takes it at the four. There's a flag on the play. There's a missed tackle. Clipping, Clipping. on the receiving, on the receiving team. team. After the first down. First down. First down. First down. They'll start this drive at the 13-yard line. They use four linebackers. Number 92 brings him down at the 14-yard line. That'll be a pickup of a yard. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on their own 14. They come out with four linebackers. Little handoff. To the 30. He's knocked out of bounds at the 36-yard line. That was a nice run. Boy, he did a nice job of keeping his feet moving. Good, solid run. First and 10. Ball on their own 36. Indiana sets up in the eye. Jones steps back to pass. Let's it fly. Complete. Jackson with a takedown at the 40-yard line. How about that play? That's a good pickup there. He just dropped back and delivered a nice throw. Second and six. Ball on the 40-yard line. Michigan comes out in a 4-3. Jones back to pass. He lets it go, and it's caught. He's at midfield, and he's taken down at the 45-yard line. And a nice pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz, and a quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. First and ten. Ball on the 45-yard line. And that'll be the end of the first quarter with our score. Michigan, three. Indiana, nothing. We are ready to start quarter number two. It's first and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. The Hoosiers come out in the ace formation. Steps 
Gets up in the pocket. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense, and the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. First and ten. This is the sixth play of this drive. Three wideouts here. Jones fakes a handoff. He passes it. Complete. They'll bring him down at the 11. A good pickup on the play-action pass. It's first and ten. Seventh play of this drive coming up. Indiana comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Drops back to pass. He fires right with the interception. He tried to force that one in there. Yeah, but the safety made him pay for a terrific read and a nice catch. First and ten. Ball on their own 20. They'll use a 4-4 defense here. Number 16 gives it up the middle, and down he goes at the 22-yard line. The running back gets two on the carry. It's second down and eight to go. Ball on the 22-yard line. Number 16 comes to the line with three wide. Number 16 gives it up the middle, shakes off a tackle, and he's taken down at the 27. They get about five yards from the halfback. It's third down and three to go. Ball on their own 27. Indiana lines up defensively at a 3-4. Finn move. They'll bring him down at the 28. They don't pick up the first on that play. Brad, that defense is saying, not so fast, my friend. You're not going to run that ball that easy. Now it's fourth down and two yards to go. Ball on the 28-yard line. Finley to punt this one away. Number 19 calls for the fair catch. He hauls it in at the 37-yard line. They'll take over at the 37-yard line. Lewis is the deep back as they line up in the eye. He's hit and got away, and he's tackled at the 41-yard line. Four yards on that play. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 41. Indiana going with three backs here. Jones hands off to the left. Number six brings him down at the 43-yard line. A yard, maybe two on the carry. Third and four, ball on the 43-yard line. Jones with three wide receivers. Throws it out there, and it's caught, and he's taken down at the 43. Oh, my, that long game gives him a first down, Coach. A first down and a nice pass play. Knowing you can convert on third and long will open up your offense a little bit more on first and second. Let's see what they do from here. First and ten, ball on the 43. Indiana comes to the line with three wide.
Number six with a takedown at the 43-yard line. No gain. Second and ten. Fifth play of this drive coming up. Michigan lines up in a dime defense here. Complete. Drake brings him down at the 34-yard line. And a nice catch by the wideout that time. Third and one coming up on this play. Ball on the 34-yard line. The Hoosiers line up in an eye formation. And down he goes at the 34-yard line. Nothing gained on the play. Fourth and one coming up. Ball on the 34. They're crowding the line. Lewis on the give. Number six tackles him for a loss on the play. Well, they'll turn it over on downs. Did they have to go for it there? Well, sometimes you gotta take your chances. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. They'll go to work at the 34. Defense lines up in a 3-4. He drops back. He throws it. Number 83 has it. The Wolverines call for a timeout, and they'll have two remaining. Second and two coming up here. Ball on the 42-yard line. Nickel defense. pass he's under pressure it falls incomplete and they do a good job at swatting that one away you're right Brad excellent awareness by the defender to know where the football is and his get his hand on it third and two ball on the 42 yard line The Hoosiers use a four-man front here. They hand it off. Gets past the tackler. Juku. Gonzalez with a takedown at the 45. Michigan calls a timeout. That was their second timeout. First and ten. Ball on the 45. First and ten. Ball on the 45-yard line. Four-man front by the defense. Number 16 drops back to pass. He's looking for his man. Carter brings him down at the 32. He got up in the air and made the catch. Well, that's all about timing, too, because if he jumped too early, he wouldn't have been able to catch that ball. Number 16 drops back. He unloads it. Incomplete pass. The wide receiver couldn't catch up to that ball. And you know what? No one could have caught up to that one. He just misfired it. So it's second and ten. Sixth play of this drive coming up. Defense lines up in a 3-4. Number 16 steps back to pass. Let's it go. And they couldn't hook up on that one. He was way out in front on that one. Yeah, there was no chance for the tight end to catch up to that ball there. Third and ten. Seventh play of this drive coming up. Indiana brings in the nickel here. Drops back to pass. He's looking. Going deep. What an amazing catch 
First down. Boy, Brad, you said it. That is a big-time play there. Spectacular catch and great body control there on the long pass reception. Looks like they're going to try to power this one in. Gonzalez tackles him for a loss on the play. He was stopped in his tracks on that one. Oh, yeah, and that's because of the nice pursuit by the defense there. Number 16, back to pass. Let's it fly. And it's caught for the touchdown. And a nice catch by the receiver for the touchdown. Anytime you're near the red zone, you got to keep an eye for this guy. They love going to him down here. And he tacks on the extra point. Down to just a few seconds left here before the half. And our score, Michigan 10, Indiana nothing. Michigan lines up for the kickoff. Kicks it off. Carter fields it at the nine. I take this kid aside and shake him. He ran right into the coverage team. They'll get the ball here at the 17. The Wolverines come out in a 34 defense. They hand it off. Brought down at the 22. Folks, let's pause now as we've reached the end of the first half. Our score at halftime, Michigan 10, Indiana nothing. Michigan will be kicking off to start the second half. Not a real deep kick, should be returned. Carter takes it at the eight. They'll start this drive at the 30. Indiana sets up in the eye. They hand it off. And he's tackled at the 37. Seven-yard play. Second and three coming up. Ball on the 37. The Hoosiers go with the eye formation. On the ground, up the middle. Number six with a takedown at the 43. They pick up a good six yards there. First and ten, ball on the 43-yard line. Nickel defense, he drops back, he lets it go, picks it off. He's at the 30, inside the 20, the 10, and he's all the way in for the touchdown. That last INT gives this defense two on the day. Not a good throw there, and the quarterback needs to make better decisions.
and he hits the PAT. So with under five minutes left in the third quarter, our score, Michigan 17, Indiana nothing. Michigan to kick. Kicks it off. Number 19 fields it at the nine. They'll take over at the 27. The Wolverines use a four-man front here. A handoff. He's to the 40. He's to the 50. And he's finally taken down at the 45. How do you like that run? I'll tell you what. If you're the defensive coach, you don't like this at all. In fact, you're probably... Disgusting. No doubt, coach. That fullback made this defense look bad on that play. It's first and ten. Ball on the 45. Defense lines up in a 3-4. Jones gives it up the middle. Tackle at the 43. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. It's second down and eight. Ball on the 43. Michigan comes out in a 3-4. Hand off up the middle. And he stopped behind the line. Instead of running around the defenders, he ran right into them. I don't think it mattered if he ran left or right or over the top. They just lost the battle up front. It's third down and eight to go. Ball on the 43-yard line. Michigan comes out defensively with six defensive backs. Jones drops the throw. He passes it. Incomplete. Man, he had to get rid of that ball in a hurry. You know, it seems like he's allowing the defense right now to control him by throwing bad passes under pressure. What he needs to do is make some plays and start controlling the defense instead. Fourth down, eight yards to go. Ball on the 43-yard line. Curry, back deep to return. Curry signals for a fair catch. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. They'll go to work at the 20. Defense lines up in a 3-4. the option brought down at the 26 the quarterback trying to make a play well he did a nice job of getting some yards there on the scramble but he needs to learn to slide to avoid those big hits second and four coming up here all on the 26 yard line Indiana lines up defensively in a 4-3 Number 16, back to throw. He steps up, looks. He goes downtown. And that one's fallen incomplete. It's third down and four to go. Ball on the 26. The Wolverines have five receivers on this play. Number 16 drops back. He guns it to the right, and it's caught. And with that catch, he goes over 100 yards receiving for the game.
First and ten. Ball on the 36. The defense will stack the line of scrimmage. Play action. Throws it out there. Complete. They'll bring him down at the 48-yard line. And they get the first down on that completion, Coach. That was a very nice first down conversion. The key to that play was the fact that the quarterback had plenty of time to look downfield. It's first and ten. Fifth play of this drive coming up. They use four linebackers. He's at the 40. Tackle at the 34. He got a really nice gain on that run. Brad, I'm going to tell you, I think the defense needs to make some adjustments. Maybe move eight or nine guys into the box lead. Maybe they could slow down this running game. You're right, Kirk. Heck, I could run through those holes. First and ten. This is the sixth play of this drive. The Hoosiers come out in a 4-3. Number 16 gives it up the middle. Number 50 brings him down at the 34. Nothing going on that one. Second and 10. Ball on the 34-yard line. Indiana going with a three-man front. Back to pass. He throws it. Incomplete pass. And he threw that one up for grabs. This is one of the things that drives a coach crazy. You don't want to do anything stupid. Make mental mistakes that may cost you the ball game. It's third down and 10. Ball on the 34-yard line. Michigan comes out with five receivers. Drop back to pass. He's looking for his man. And they make the stop at the 27. Fourth down, Coach. Yeah, they just didn't get enough yardage on that pass. It's fourth down and three yards to go. Ball on the 27. They're going to try a long field goal here. It's up. And it sails right on him. No good. They'll get the ball here at the 27-yard line. Three-man front defensively. Number 97 with a takedown at the 34. A nice seven-yard run by the fullback. The second down and three to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. And that's the end of the third quarter. Our score in this one, Michigan 17, Indiana nothing. And we're ready for the start of the fourth quarter. Second and three, ball on their own 34. Lewis lines up in the deep back, eye formation. Jones gives it up the middle. Brought down at the 34-yard line. The running back gets a yard, maybe less. Third down and three coming up. Ball on the 34-yard line. The Wolverines line up in a 3-4. Jones options out. Now he pitches it. And they hit him in the backfield. Well, the defense really put the clamps down on that run. Boy, Greg, great effort up front by that defense. It's fourth down now, five yards to go. Ball on the 32. 4-3 defense. Jones drops back to pass. He unloads it. Number 87 makes a catch. 
A nice completion to the tight end. A good play here, and the thing that I notice is that he provides a nice big target out there for the quarterback. It's first and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. They come out in a nickel. Jones steps back to pass. And it's caught. Number 21 brings him down at the 46-yard line. Nice little catch there, huh, Coach? Yeah, that was a good call. I like that call. I like short passes. They're safe and can lead to some really good yardage. It's second down and six to go. Ball on their own 46. Michigan comes out in a 4-3. Lewis gets it on a pitch. And they got him for a loss. So the toss play to the tailback goes nowhere. Third down and 12 to go. Seventh play of this drive coming up. Indiana comes out in the shotgun. Complete, and down he goes at the 48-yard line. And Herbie, that was a good-looking throw. Yeah, and what impresses me is the composure of this young quarterback. He made a great read, saw the open receiver, and delivered an almost perfect strike. Good-looking play. Fourth and inches coming up here. Ball on the 48-yard line. They come out in the Maryland eye. The handoff on the counter. And he's taken down at the 45. And they kept it on the ground, and that gives them the first. Well, this is a situation we have to rely on the offensive line. Great execution up front. They've got just enough for the first down. He drops back. Steps up. Guns it across the middle. Number 87. Drops it. It's second down and 10 to go. This is the 10th play of this drive. Defense lines up in a 4-3. Back to pass. Looking. Let's it go. And it's caught. Spins up field. They'll bring him down at the 15-yard line. Let's have another look at that pass, guys. Well, Brad here is just a great throw by the quarterback. He does a great job of getting the ball to the receiver quickly. Therefore, the defense doesn't have enough time to break on the ball. Jones drops the throw. He's looking. He's scrambling. Let's it fly. Tipped away. Nice job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. Second and ten. Ball on the 15. Two tight ends set. Jones back to pass. He lets it go. Complete. He's hit and got away. The five. Touchdown, Hoosier. Looked like the defense just forgot about the tight end on that play. Yeah, he seemed to slip right through the secondary and find an opening. I can't believe the defense allowed that to happen. Especially in the red zone, Kirk. They got to be aware of this guy's pass catching abilities. And he tacks on the extra point. So under three minutes to go in the fourth quarter. And the score is Indiana 7, Michigan 17. There's not enough time for them to make a defensive stop, so they'll try the onside kick. They were really hoping to get the ball back there. Well, now they have to call on their defense to make something happen. They need a big play right here to get that ball back. Right. 
They'll start this drive at the 43. Defense lines up, eight men in the box. Smith with a takedown at the 42. And they're going to play keep away and work this clock. Second and nine, ball on the 42-yard line. They'll use a 4-4 defense here. Perry gets the ball left side. Number 15 brings him down at the 41. And they continue to pound it out on the ground. Tick, 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 continue to milk that clock. Third and eight, ball on the 41-yard line. The Hoosiers line up in a nickelback. Little handoff. Jones with a takedown at the 40. The Hoosiers are going to take a timeout, and that was their first timeout. Fourth and seven, ball on the 40-yard line. Finley, back to punt. Number 19, calls for the fair catch. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. They'll take over at the 20-yard line. The Wolverines come out in a 4-3. Jones back to throw. He guns it to the left, and it falls incomplete. Boy, would he like to have that one back. Yeah, you're right. This offense relies so much on timing, and as you saw there, when their timing gets knocked off, they have a tough time connecting on plays like this. Second and ten, ball on the 20-yard line. High formation here. Jones drops back to pass. He passes it. Jackson brings him down at the 33-yard line. How about that reception, Lee? A good throw plus a nice catch and some good blocking equals to a chunk of yards. That's exactly what you practice all the time, Brad. First and five, ball on their own 38. Jones steps back to pass, throws it out there, and it's caught. Tackle at the 46-yard line. Indiana takes a timeout, and now they've only got one remaining. It's first and 10, ball on their own 46. They'll use a 4-4 defense here. Drops back to pass. Complete, and they make the stop at the 31. Not a bad pickup that time. Yeah, but let me tell you the reason why this play worked. The defense came with pressure, but they couldn't quite get to the quarterback. And he made them pay right there. The spike will stop the clock. Right. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 31. The Hoosiers go with the I formation. He drops back. He throws it. Number 87 hangs on to it. Six yards that time on the pass play. Jones drops back. He's looking for his man. And it's knocked away. And the safety got a hand on it that time.
Fourth and four. They're in field goal range. Indiana comes to the line with three wide. Lewis gets a pitch, and he stopped behind the line. They went for it, but they were denied. Well, that was a situation where they had to go for it. I agree. They can't afford to let the other team hold on to the ball. The time is ticking away. They'll go to work at the 28. Indiana lines up defensively in a 4-3. The defense calls a timeout, and that was their last timeout. Second and 12 coming up here. Ball on the 26. The Hoosiers put four men up front. Third and 14 coming up here. Ball on the 24-yard line. And this ball game's over. Coach, what's your final thought on the game? Well, it's a little closer than most people would have expected, but I'm sure they'll take it. Michigan didn't play their best game, and they'll admit it. But this is college football, where every game counts. And if you win, you're happy. If you lose, you're not. It's that simple. Folks, that's going to do it for this edition of NCAA Football 2003. We hope you join us again. Our final score, Michigan 17, Indiana 7. So for Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye, everybody, and thanks for tuning in.